How did everyone sleep? I was so tired. Same. Same. Don't point at me. This is rude to point. Enjoy my coffee, make brekkie, and then I'm running late. Now, we're not running late yet, but we do have to leave in like less than five minutes. I just got some new stuff from White Fox, so I wanna wear a new hoodie. Do we do gray? Look, it doesn't really matter. We're just going to swimming lessons at the moment. I don't know, I have like goals and intentions for the day because let me tell you, I keep falling back into this really bad cycle of like just scraping by and just really neglecting my health, my fitness, and just like my sense of wellness. Last week, especially, I just had no sense of balance. Like I was just pouring everything into the boys. Yeah, and I just don't feel good. Like I don't feel good in my body. Yeah, let's do this with a black hat. The amount of times I go out with a tag though. Let's chop that off. I had full intention of doing my skincare routine, but honestly, something's gotta give in the morning. Yet again, something's gotta give and it is me. Whenever I don't have time to do my skincare routine or like get ready, I just throw on a hat. I feel like that, yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, as long as you smell good, right? And maybe we'll change my socks. Those that get it, get it and those that don't I don't know if you're just like a superhuman like I said I talk about this a lot I feel like I get in this routine of like having really good habits and like the habits I keep slipping out of or the bad habits I keep falling into are the same it's Monday I know they say you can start a goal you can start a new routine any day of the week I'm a Monday girl right like it's the start of the week I'm setting intentions for the week yeah the habit I keep falling into which surely I'm not the only mum no joke I live off bars my first meal of the day is always healthy. By the end of the day, I've had like my avocado toast with eggs, great. And then I have a muesli bar and then I have a protein bar and then I'm like running somewhere else to pick up fox and I'm having another muesli bar. Like I literally live off bars. It's not a nice feeling. I just know I can feel so much better so easily by just like some simple tweaks. So I went on my Instagram story and I was saying like my goal of the week is eat lunch. Like eat a proper lunch and not a protein bar. What am I doing? I literally cannot talk to you guys and multi-talk. Okay, jumper, shirt, trackies, undies, shoes. The goals are really achievable and I feel like we can all kind of do these, but it's mostly food related. And then my nighttime routine, like my nighttime routine is setting me up for failure. Like I go to bed way too late. I'm on my phone way too late and I'm the only one who can change that and I know that. So this is a fresh week, okay? I'm gonna start habits that are maintainable and healthy and like not intense, but just I know I'm gonna feel better for it. Oh, I know what I was going to say. So last night I did our grocery shopping. Whoa, like I just... a Whoa. I didn't buy any box because we're all going to eat whole foods. Like the way you guys eat, I'm going to now eat again. Sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan. The first non-negotiable of the day is I want to drink three of these. I used to and I'm still breastfeeding so I should be. But again, I just like forget. Okay. Oh, do you know what I should do? What makes me feel so good is when I actually move my body. Like I get steps in. So let's track today. Do we have everything? Do we have everything? Phone, wallet, keys, don't, oh no. Kurt took my car. No! I'm a short girl, okay? And when I have to take Kurt's car, it just makes life actually so much harder. Not only does he have a huge ute, he's raised his ute, like lifted it. All right, boys, let's go. He's so angry. Do you know what I forgot, Fox? My sunnies. Ooh, Dad has sunnies in here. Should we see if they suit me? No. I think no. Um, they're yours? They're not mine, they're Dad's. So who is calling me? Your dad. Hello? Hey, what time the boys get up? Oh, Daddy. Oh, it's fresh. But the sun's warm, so you'll be you'll be all right. Far out, Kurt. Getting the boys in this car, or getting Malachi yeah. in this car. Yes, you. Oh, Malachi. sorry. 
See you guys, have fun at swimming. Bye. Oh, I've just had the realization that I've left the pram at home. I don't know why I thought it was in the back of this car, but it's not. Now I have a crawling baby who is just going to get saturated and crawl all over the pool floor. running off no groceries right now. Like I said, my groceries are coming this afternoon. This was the only bread we had left in the house, like the end bits, and it's like smoking. Cursing. It's boiling though. I know, hot, you hold it up. Yeah. Oh, I'm craving scrambled eggs, but we don't have any eggs. Today's healthy eating is also like therapeutic because I'm just gonna get rid of everything in the fridge. Random bits of tomato, avo, cottage cheese. You either get this or it's gonna completely gross you out. I grew up having tuna on toast. Honestly, nearly every morning, it's one of my favorite breakfasts, which is very convenient because I always have tuna in the cupboard, but I've run out of eggs. As long as I have a good source of protein in the morning, I don't really care whether it's eggs, tuna. I'm not really into protein shakes at the moment. I'm more of a savory gal. Yum, yum, yum. Should we do some chili flakes? Okay, can you cut it once and then I'm gonna put it on my plate. Thank you. Mummy's brekkie is served. I want to eat more fruit, vegetables, healthy food, and less foods in a packet. Because it makes me feel better. When I eat really like foods like this, it makes me feel good. You want to eat rosemary? Rosemary. Turkey. Yeah, turkey. There's nothing wrong with muesli bars, but I would rather... Why do you, you, you think you have muesli bars all the time? I think I have a low-key sugar addiction right now, addicted to like the fake chocolate, fake caramel thing going on. So I just want to encourage my body to go to fruit. I just want to wean off my muesli bar addiction, like it's real. <laughs> so everything in there is clean. See how it gets a bit wet? So what I usually do, wash over the top. How much pocket money do you think this will get you? Six. Six dollars? Mm, it's hot. <laughs> about this hairstyle. I have a little confession about it. I'm also a hack. It's like a hack. So I have always had really fine hair. Like I just don't have a lot of hair. However, it's probably the healthiest and thickest it's been in like my whole adult life. Is it obvious? Cause I feel like it's not. I feel like it blends really well. But I've thrown a clip-in extension just here and I've like swooped some of it back and then brought some of it down and I just cut it to fit my fringe, like my curtain fringe. I feel like it looks good. I learned this little hack or technique on my activewear photo shoot, my hairdresser Lily put in two extensions, it was life-changing. Like this look, this style without these two pieces just doesn't look as good, doesn't look as full. Anyway, we have a meeting in like 45 minutes. So you guys are gonna help me pick what to wear, okay? Thanks. Okay, surely some of my new stuff will work. I'm going for casual business. You know, like chill, like I don't care. So everything here is from White Fox Boutique, obviously. And they're having their Black Friday 2.0 sale. So my code Sarah is 30% off, but only until the 30th of June. And then it goes back down to 15%. Oh, yes, okay. This is the color blue jean that I don't have. Let's go to my Pinterest board. So this is mine. And whenever I get bored, I just scroll on Pinterest and pin the vibe I'm into. Maybe we could do her. I reckon we could do that with these jeans. Oh man, I'm in between sizes. Like sometimes I'm an extra small, sometimes I'm a small. I think I ordered everything in extra small. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Who's that girl? Straight leg jean. <sighs> oh no. Let's put a blazer on. All right, this one is the White Fox Oversized Boyfriend. This is option one. Casual, but we're taking it serious. Okay, I need to steam this one and not wear my sports bra underneath. I kind of like it out, like completely out. Our meeting is at a cafe, which I'm pretty sure will sit outside. So the sunglasses are actually a part of the look. Let's wear like actual boots with a bit of a heel. How does it look just over, over my shoulders? 
too bulky. Guys, you need to see it with the shoes. I think this is our winning option so far. Casual capsule undone. Okay, that's a good option. And then I can just come straight home, take off my boots, take off my shirt, and then put on the college jumper that didn't quite make our outfit this morning. Look at that. These are my new fave. Oh, no. Yes, I got them in cream as well. Oh, yes. Normally, this is kind of what I would lounge around the house in. I think we need to come up with a few more options. These, I think, are my favorite. Okay, I need to steam them. Oh, I just love them. I got this new figure it out tee. Do we try a jean? Oh my gosh, we need to do it with these ones. That first look. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, I'm swapping, I'm swapping. These are nice. This is the White Fox Faux Leather. Oh, I can't pick. Let me try it without the PU. We'll do the blazer. I like this better than the PU. Leather, pleather, you know? Can we stick with these or design, color, color. Let's go color. Do we go a bit 90s? Let's just, two blessed tea. Let's try that. Oh, this is nice. I think this is winning. Let's put some gold hoops on. And I think these are good. I always mix up my gold, but this is what I've been wearing for the past like two weeks these on these are not white fox okay do we do a belt let's do it and then we can always take it off should we go with this one or do we go back <laughs> do we go back to these or last option last option i swear we'll keep the belt so i think i'm gonna bring my active wear with me and a cleanser and go straight from my meeting to the gym because if i come home i know that i'll just like put a load of washing on start dinner prep play with the boys i wear a rendition of this every day but i'm just i really love the color of this blue you know when your jeans are like just a little bit too tight and then you try to tuck in a shirt it's like that's not gonna happen what do we think okay no i'm gonna be adjusting this too much and i wear it all the time oh <gasps> i got this bodysuit with a zip but like I said, it's like a jumpsuit. Should we just try it while we're here? While we're here. For the lols. Last one. Last one. Jumpsuit base. Probably not. You could do this. I'm not going to. But I do think these would look better. Or is it giving the rock? I always want to wear some kind of black turtleneck, jeans and a belt. And every time I wear it, people just say it's giving the rock. That's cooler. I'm just going around and around in circles, people. I don't have time for this now. We really have to pick an outfit, stick to it. I will link them in the description box. So if you click that, it's site-wide and it just doesn't include collaboration products. Okay, I think this is cool. Yeah, we're gonna go for this. Do I have any tags? Yes, I do. Ooh, that's a cool. I could like go out in this. I don't go out though, but if you do, you should go out in this. I love this. Now shoes, my punk boots yes definitely i love this yep i love it i would take me seriously okay last thing do we do any of the gold out or is it trying too hard yeah i think we just keep it clean cool guys you didn't tell me my extension was showing okay are we good are we good whatever it's fine whatever who cares white fox does accept afterpay for us new zealand and australian customers so right now the sale is live but like i said it ends on the 30th of june at midnight if you want to use my code sarah you get 30 percent off site wide but after that if you're watching this vlog and it's not the 30th of june it's later you can still use my code for 15 percent off abby when did you get there Come here, where did you get there? Every time I get ready for like a meeting or I need to go somewhere, I leave a room like this. And like Kurt knows I'm good for it. When I get home, I'll clean it all up. But like now is not the time. Now is not the time. Anyway, thank you White Fox for sponsoring today's video. I'm gonna go pack my bag. I'm gonna pack my active wear, my skincare stuff, and I'll move to some capacity. Wish me luck at my meeting. Don't you dare even try to judge me. I know, I'm home. It's 2.40, not sweaty, I'm not in my active wear. I ran out of time, okay? We spent too much time planning our outfit, so I just ended up grabbing my bag and my business stuff. My business stuff. Grabbing my bag and my phone and my wallet. I didn't even bring a laptop. And I went to my meeting, it went really well, and I didn't have time to grab my fitness stuff. Like, what is wrong with my vocab? I didn't have time to grab my gym stuff, okay? I also just realized that I don't have a car. I ended up having to get an Uber to this meeting, whatever. We only have one car today because mine's getting fixed. And Kurt has it, and he has taken the boys to the park. So I thought I would come home, have a snack, then I'll go to the gym. But this is when, this is when my habits change, okay? I don't even know if we have any right now. Usually I would come to this cupboard and I would pick 
my favorite muesli bar. I'm addicted. We have like these Carmen's ones. They're not my favorite, but like I would totally go for it. Little protein bars. And usually I would have 20 times more. But like I said, my groceries are coming. Did I order more muesli bars? Maybe I just ordered some for the boys, not me. Popcorn. You know, like we still have snacks. Don't get me wrong. My boys eat really healthy, but they still have like little packets of chips and stuff. This is where we're going to change it together. Okay. Albert Einstein said the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over again and expecting a different result. Do I want a banana or do I want an apple? What one am I going to feel better off as a pre-workout? Apple. Hey Siri, call Kurt. Our team at the office laugh at Kurt and I for using Siri so much. At Colonel Park. And I go to the gym soon. How about I go to the gym when you guys go to jujitsu and then you pick me up? Yeah, okay, good plan. Yeah? Might even be able to pick the car up before that, so yeah. Cool. See ya. Great. If I cannot touch my phone for the day, that's ideal. Like I will, hey Siri, everything. Add to my notes, message this person, call this person. And I feel like this is the truth. It's so efficient, but everyone laughs at us and they're like, oh my gosh, you're such millennials. I'm like, boo. That's not a millennial thing. That's just being a busy time poor mom who runs a business who's trying to be like efficient, right? Millennials aren't even old school, by the way. So shut up. Dumb. You're distracting me. I'm distracting you. <laughs> I'm distracting you. Yes, you're distracting me. And I find myself here mm. yet again. I'm making a tea, I'm having an ice cream, like that's fine, that's not my bad habit. My bad habit is making lunches and cleaning the house at 10 p.m. Some nights this is unavoidable, but this is my every night. If this topic resonates with you and you're in a season like me, where you're trying to replace maybe some not so good habits with healthy habits, then please comment below because I'd love to not reshoot this vlog, but create a dedicated video of little things that I'm going to try to do to have a better sense of balance in my life. Let me know and I will talk to you in the next vlog. Bye!